Last night, for the first time in 28 years, Old Dominion and Hampton met on the basketball court. By all accounts, the game was a smashing success. I mean, one of the reasons that I wanted to play this game is because I think the fans want and deserve a game like this. I mean, the scope was electric tonight. This is the way it should be for every game we play. It bodes well for alumni in, in, in the Tidewater area uh, because they want to they see Hampton University play top quality teams. Almost 8,000 fans showed up to see the Monarchs win an exciting contest that wasn't decided until the final minutes of play. And while the game probably didn't have any profound impact on records or standings, local fans who are hungry for big-time sports events left hoping this game can become an annual attraction. It makes me very proud. It makes me the ODU's number one fan. I love them very proud of my school. I love it. I'm going to say it's madness. But a big factor in whether or not this series will, in fact, continue next year is location, whether next year's game will be played here at Scope or at Hampton University's Convocation Center. The Pirates moved up to Division I from Division II just this season, and traditionally the step up means scheduling home games against more established Division I teams, such as ODU, can be an elusive affair. Hampton officials, who'd like to host future games with ODU, are hoping the interest in this year's game will help the series to continue on an alternating home court rotation. We'd like to continue playing it. We'd like to get some of the games at our place. So we'd play it again next year. After they uh, get into Division I and to move up in the RPI, that, that, you know, it, it probably is something that makes sense. So as of now, there's no firm commitment for a rematch next year. But hopefully for area basketball fans, the two schools can reach an agreement because the real winners of last night's game were the folks holding ticket stubs. In Norfolk, Stan Verrett for TV10 Sports.